What's up guys, um, Fabian, also known as the Marvel Fan FBI 10, here going to do a review on the, I believe this is series one, uh, wave one of the Marvel Infinite series. Um, pretty new to the line, um, for most of you that don't know, I collected uh, Marvel Universe, I did a lot of Marvel Universe reviews and all that, so sad to see the line kind of go away. Let me adjust the lighting real quick. Kind of sad to see the, the line go. But at the same time, you know, it's cool to see a new line come in, take its place. So, um, here we have Captain America. Um, figure we've gotten in the Marvel Universe line uh, about a million times. Um, but I'm a big Captain America fan, so um, I'm, I'd, I'd gladly pick it up. So, uh, first thing off the review, um, just want to show you guys the packaging. Um, I've heard, I've seen reviews on this guy, seen people talk about the packaging for the, for the new, um, or the new packaging, as you can see. Or, not so new, um, I'm more new to it than anybody, but, uh, yeah. Uh, you guys are gonna experience, you guys are gonna go with the experiences I go. So, for most of you this may be new, for most of you it may not be, but, yeah. Um, it's a big blister card in the middle. Uh, it has uh, Thor, Captain America, Iron Man, and Hulk's uh, symbols, I guess. And then it has the big Marvel Infinite Series logo on top. It's Captain America on the bottom. And in the back, you have Captain America, a bio, a really, really small bio. Um, other the other uh, five characters that come in the line. And that's pretty much it that you get to see in the on the packaging. So very simplistic, uh, very basic. Uh, the Marvel Universe one had in my hand, I mean in my my book, it had a, I want to say better packaging. Uh, I do like the simplistic and the basicness that is this packaging, but I like the Marvel Universe, Marvel Universe one better. So now that we've, you know, seen this, let's open them up. So stick around guys, I'll be right back. So here we have uh, Captain America, outside of this package. Ing. <laughs> but uh, yeah, mm. real cool figure, real basic, um, nothing too special. Um, just reusing a, an older mold. Um, I believe the first time we saw this was with the Daredevil and Bullseye 2 pack, I'm not sure. But, uh, yeah, uh, I believe that's when it was, uh, first introduced. Um, but one thing you'll see me use in the video is the stand. The, the figure, one, does not come with a stand, and two, it's pretty... I found it a little difficult to pose, so I brought out a stand and, uh, used it instead. But one thing it does come with is the shield. Um, so... Let's set Captain America aside and take a look at his shield. So the shield is, is metallic, red, gray, blue. Um, in the back, little plastic hold, a uh, little plastic kind of like cuff thing, which is which really really sucks. I found it difficult to to put it on his wrist and keep it there. Um, I wish Hasbro would have done. A thing where they they um, attach little rubber straps here, and so that he could hold it hold it right. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, you know, what are you gonna do? Maybe maybe add it to maybe do it myself later. So do it yourself later. You know, maybe upload a video on that. But until then, I'm gonna have a little struggle with this. So I'm gonna set that aside. Bring out Captain America. Um. One thing right off the bat I saw, and I guess I liked and I sort of didn't like at the same time, was um, these, the things that are supposed to be part of his boots. Um, I like that they were sculpted, but I don't like that they were sculpted onto the boots. The, the right one, for some reason, just won't stay up there for too long. And another thing I had... 
uh, that was wrong with the figure was his his chest was a little loose. So that's going to happen. It's something that you can't see in the packaging, so you have to take a wild um, guess on which ones are going to be good and which ones aren't. Um, aside from that articulation, his head goes up pretty far up, goes down pretty far down. So that's pretty cool. You can put him in some pretty cool poses. He his uh, chest kind of moves back and forth just a bit. Arm rotates fully. Goes pretty high up. Uh, single hinge. Uh, rotates 360. His waist also rotates, so that's pretty cool. Double articulation. Um, T jointed a leg or upper thigh area. Um, you can swivel it double jointed. Um, did I say single hinge up here? <laughs> single joint. Double jointed knee. Uh, rotates at the boot, so that's pretty cool. Uh, ankles move up and down and side to side. So, with the help of a stand, you guys can put uh, this guy and yeah, some pretty pretty cool poses so overall um, if you haven't picked up a Captain America yet in the three and three quarter inch scale um, there's something wrong with you there's been millions out there if not trillions um, but by far I'd like to say this is the better Captain America don't quote me on that I have more Captain Americas, but I have them somewhere else, and I don't want to get them right now. But yeah, this has been a, a review on the Marvel Universe, I mean not Marvel Universe, look at me. The Marvel Infinite Series, uh, Wave 1, Series 1, Captain America. Uh, stay tuned, the rest of the line will be reviewed pretty soon. Thanks for watching.